Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. To replace the control board in this Frigidaire air conditioner, you will need a number 2 Phillips head screwdriver, needle nose pliers, wire cutters, zip ties, and a putty knife. Before you begin, unplug the unit's power cord. To perform this procedure, you will need to fully uninstall the unit from the wall sleeve or window and set it on a sturdy surface. Now pull out the air filter. Use the number two Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the two screws, securing the grill assembly. With the screws unthreaded, use the putty knife to help pry the grill assembly off. Release the control panel wiring from the retainers to provide enough slack to set the grill aside. Next, unthread the six screws to release the rear grill if attached. Unthread the lower screws, securing the left and right side air intake screens. Detach the screens from the top to remove. Now unthread the eight screws, securing the unit's cabinet. With the screws unthreaded, lift the cabinet off. Cut the foam strip insulation covering the control box cover. Unthread the three screws securing the cover. Set the cover aside. Note the orientation of the wires connected to the control board. Then release the wire connector locks or pull back the wire insulators as necessary to disconnect all of the wires. You can use the needle nose pliers to depress the locking tabs to release the applicable wires. Remove the two pieces of sealing gum.
Use the wire cutters to cut the zip tie securing the wiring to the side of the control box so you can move the wiring out of the way. Next, unthread the screw securing the control board mounting frame to the control box. Fully remove the frame and unthread the two screws securing the board. Pull back the retaining tabs to fully release the old board. To install the new control board, insert it into the mounting frame and thread the two screws to secure. Insert the lower tabs on the frame into the slots in the control box. And rethread the screw at the top. Now connect all of the wires to the appropriate terminals on the board. Replace the wire connector locks and slide the insulators over the terminals as necessary. Use a new zip tie to secure the wiring to the side of the control box. Replace the sealing gum and bend back the wire retainer to help secure the wiring. Reposition the control box cover and rethread the screws to secure. Realign the cabinet and rethread the eight screws. Replace the left and right side air intake screens and rethread the lower screws. If applicable, reinstall the rear grill. Secure the control panel wiring in the retainers. Align the top tabs of the grill assembly with the slots in the top edge of the unit and snap the assembly into position. Thread the two mounting screws.
Keeping the upper lip facing outward, insert the air filter into the front grille slot. Reinstall the unit in the wall sleeve or window as necessary. Plug the power cord back in, and the air conditioner should be ready for use.